Hi everyone, uh, welcome to the session. Uh, in this session, we'll discuss about uh, the changes in the CMA exam uh, from 2020. Uh, I'll cover mainly on uh, CMA part one, what uh, changes that are going to take place in the syllabus and when it is going to affect. CMA part one, the title is going to be financial planning, performance and analytics. So the title from next year onwards is going to be financial planning, performance and control. As you all know that the present uh, title of CMA part one is financial reporting, planning, performance and control. Let me share with you the sections, the content, what we have along with the weightage uh, given by the Institute of Management Accountants. The current syllabus at the moment now for this year 2019 we have uh, five sections a to e external financial reporting financial budgeting and forecasting performance management cost management and internal controls with the respective weightages given as per the ia you know I, ima the topic is going to change to the title is going to change to financial planning performance and analysis and this time we'll have uh, six sections a new topic or uh, a new section called section f technology and analytics is added with 15 percent weightage the rest all remain same in addition to that we will have one extra section which is technology and analytics but in addition to this there is a small change uh, which we'll discuss now here you can see um, first thing is the title as you know that the title is going to change cma part one financial reporting planning performance and control is going to change to financial planning performance and uh, analytics the weightage for external financial reporting decisions will remain same 15 percent financial budgeting uh, and forecasting the 2019 window will have uh, 30 percent but it is going to change to 20 percent so 30 percent weightage is going to change to 20 percent performance management will remain same weightage remains same cost management at the moment we have 20 percent weightage and it is going to be only 15 percent means what we will have some less weightage from the next year internal controls will be same 15 percent weightage so as you know that the planning and budgeting weightage is reduced by 10 percent and the cost management weightage is reduced by five percent the change in the weightage in these two sections which is 15 percent now is added in a new topic called new section section f technology and analytics which is 15 percent so the additional topics are going to cover or are going to be covered in technology and analytics and the percentage is adjusted from section b and section d of existing content so very first thing the changes what we can observe is the title the title is going to change 
from financial reporting, planning, performance, and control to financial planning, performance, and analytics. And the next thing is the content. As you know, that the content is going to be adjusted from section B and section D, 10% um, and 5% respectively. And this would be added in a new section called technology and analytics. And the weightage given is 15%. Now, what is deleted from the existing syllabus? From the existing syllabus, the deleted topic is internal auditing. As you all know that internal auditing is a part of internal controls. So what we understand is though the internal auditing is deleted from the internal controls topic, still the weightage remain 15%. So from Jan 2020 onwards, we'll not have internal auditing section or topic in our CMA part one. And the added content is technology and analytics. This is given as 15% weightage due to the requirement of the technology and analytics where you need to enhance your skills on the technology and analytics side. I will cover a detailed uh, topics, uh, section wise topics in the next video. But as of now, let us see the content given by the IMA under this section technology and analytics in technology and analytics you have uh, topics like information systems in which we'll be discussing about accounting information and systems erp and epm enterprise performance managed systems the next section next topic what added in the, this section is the data integrity data governance, data life cycles, and cyber attacks. And the next topic under the same section is going to be system development cycles, BPA, which is business process analysis, robotics process automation, AI, artificial intelligence, blockchain. Yep, we are going to have very advanced technology in this. And uh, we can say, in fact, we are lucky guys to know these techniques, smart contacts as well. And the last topic in uh, this section is data analytics, in which we'll, go into, we'll discuss about data progression, data to action, data mining, analytical tools, and data visualization. I just wanted to um, just let you know that this syllabus is going to change and this is going to be effectively tested from January 1st, 2020. As of now, I'll just only uh, can give you this much information on the newly added topic, but we'll discuss in detail about the content, the topics where you need to concentrate on um, and in a detailed study of this section f in the next coming videos until then have a good time see you again in the next lecture